Southbound is a horror anthology film made by the guys who made the anthology film VHS. And each short story is about a group of people who are traveling down a highway near a desert and a bunch of supernatural creepy stuff happens to them. So yeah, I had no idea what to expect when going into this film. Uh, I saw that it was being heavily advertised on Rotten Tomatoes and I saw that it was from the makers of VHS. So I decided to give it a shot. And I am very glad that I discovered this piece of work. This is a very nice film and it is a very nice addition to horror anthology films. I truly think that anthology films are the future of the horror genre because for some horror films, the plot kind of drags along. There's not really anything happening. All that's really there in a horror film sometimes is a bunch of jump scares and maybe a little bit of plot. There are some horror films out there that are pretty good, don't get me wrong, but the main horror films that are coming out nowadays especially in the beginning of the year, are generally terrible. But with an anthology film, especially when you're dealing with short films, you have a limited amount of time to get your story across and scare somebody. And that's why I really appreciate anthology films and how they are affecting the horror genre. However, there are anthology films out there that just really don't work because the directors aren't working together and they kind of give off different themes. ABCs of Death is a perfect example of that. However, this film actually connects some of the stories together, which I definitely enjoyed. It was a lot like Trick or Treat, where some of the stories actually connected with one another. However, they were able to maintain their own stories as well. Some of the stories connected with other stories, but they didn't play a huge part. You still were very focused on the main story that was in front of you. I also love some of the visual effects in this film and the filmmaking in general. Just the cinematography is great, the effects, there's actually a lot of creepy imagery too. Not to go into any spoilers, but it's very comparable to that episode of Courage the Cowardly Dog. I'm done now. <laughs> And there's actually one short that involves the Chad, Matt, and Rob group, and they were involved in VHS too, so I was very glad that they came back for this new production. I really want to see more stuff from them. They know how to make a good horror film. Like, I've seen a lot of their stuff on YouTube where it was the alien prank gone wrong, uh, the mountain devil prank gone wrong. They know how to make a really legitimate, scary movie with good visual effects, good visuals in general, and just... Their acting abilities are pretty good too. I enjoyed that portion of this film as well. The only complaint that I will say about this film, this was kind of a problem with each short in the film, but most of it comes from the fourth one. So you see the stories happening in front of you on the screen, but through the dialogue of the characters and through some of the things that they're talking about, you can tell that there's some kind of backstory to whatever is happening. And you're kind of left wondering, okay, what the hell is going on? I see that it's happening in front of me, but why are these characters experiencing the supernatural activity or this horror around them? The fourth one, I knew that it was a rescue mission. I knew it was a brother trying to save his sister, but there's a lot of subtext and backstory that I just didn't know what was happening whatsoever. I mean, one can say that it's left to interpretation, but you know, I would kind of like, you know, to be reminded of what's going on. I think for all the shorts, I really think that you should just approach it from a physical aspect, like just watch what's on the screen in front of you. Because if you try to look deep into it, you're gonna have a bad time. South Park references. I mean, if you want to interpret it, you can, but you know, it's, <laughs> it's gonna be kind of annoying because you're gonna pick like different pieces here and there, um, but, no, I actually had a really fun time watching this film. Uh, I love how all the stories came together and how they were somewhat connected. And I just love the spookiness and you know the visual imagery in this film. I wanna see more anthology films from these people. Also, I just realized that this is a anthology film that isn't found footage. This is kind of proof that anthology films can work without found footage. I mean, we have ABCs of death, but let's face it, it's. It's ABCs of death. So yeah, guys, that was my review on Southbound. Comment down below what you thought of this movie. If you've seen it, like the video, share it, and please subscribe to Pixel Talk if you haven't yet for more movie reviews, trailer reactions, and gaming content. I am Corbin Stuckey, and this is Pixel Talk.